future is quite uncertain and also is going to be very different to what the past was. The new champions have a very important role to play in shaping this uncertain future and making it pretty good for all of us. For that, they have to adopt innovative ways, new ways of doing things. And some of the changes which I would like to see would be the focus on culture. The focus on how they do things within their organizations and their countries and their social groups rather than what they do. I truly believe by bringing permanent change in the culture in the organization, you can create sustainable change which will shape our future much better than just focusing on innovative ideas. That does not mean innovative ideas would not rule in the coming decades. They would, and more importantly, shaped by blue ocean thinking. We do not need new incremental ideas. We need radically different ideas, which are shaped by blue ocean thinking so that we, we apply those innovative ideas to severe problems we think today, which have no solutions. So the new champions have a lot of big role to play in shaping a future and wish them success. My generation has learned that growth with little emphasis on quality is going to cost the society and the community quite a lot. And therefore, as we look ahead, quality growth is the most important mantra for sustainability. Quality growth will come from first inclusiveness in terms of we have to carry everybody across the world along with us. So therefore the distinction between developed worlds and developing worlds will fast fade away when it comes to our socially responsible behavior across the world. Our emphasis on sustainable growth and not consumption at the cost of sustainability is going to be the other critical success factor in shaping our future. And the third, I believe the most important, is the role of innovation and ideas to shape our future and driving change so that our future is more sustainable and the growth is of higher quality. Summer divorce, unlike the winter divorce, is very different because A, it is in the East, B, it is in China, and C, you get an opportunity of hearing views which are radically different than what you hear in the winter divorce. I'm very excited to participate in the summer divorce as a mentor, predominantly because we have at HCL, being amongst the fastest growing IT services company in the world, a lot to share, a lot to share on our philosophies of inclusiveness of employees first, customers second, and a lot to share about our ideas on innovation, on how you can use innovation to solve some of the world problems we face today. And I have a lot to learn. There are lots of interesting experiments which are happening across the East in, in very interesting ways where service delivery has been done at one fourth the cost as what we see in West. Innovative social agendas and social initiatives have been taken to reach out to more and more people who are below the poverty line and also objective view of what the East is thinking about their inclusion in the global economy. So there's a lot to share and a lot to learn and I'm excited to be a mentor at this summer divorce.